Colby Ag Tech is brought to you by Copperhead Ag Products. Visit copperheadag.com for more information. Ten years ago, drone technology allowed farmers to take pretty neat pictures on their farmstead. Today, drone technology is letting us do a whole lot more. Chad Colby explains. I got a unique call this week from a good friend of mine who said I bought a new drone. And what makes that interesting is it's one of the owners of Flying Ag. And Randy said, it's for my own farm. You want to come and check it out. And when I know Randy's doing that, I know the economics of the drone is starting to take place. And that's a big step when you talk about a sprayer drone. You know, they've finally gotten to where they're a large enough size that it becomes practical, you know, where you're not just constantly refilling, you know, for small acres. What about the economics of it? From a price standpoint, a sprayer drone is fairly low. You know, it's easy to get into. It's economical. Randy, the guys that you and I have been speaking with, they're four or five hundred acres a day. No problem with these systems. What are some other hurdles you've had to get through? I'm guessing the regulation is a a bigger hurdle but but even that it seems like we can get through that now pretty seamlessly correct yeah the, you know there, there are several exemptions that you need to be legal um, but there's a there's a clear-cut path for getting that done uh, so that it's not it just takes a little bit of time you know and doing it the right way uh, the other one is just how you know what's your process going to be at the field edge you know because it's all about keeping the drone in the air and so how fast can I reload you know things like that as you can see I'm swapping between the liquid system over to the dry system and it was so easy and randy's right that makes this thing really efficient and the technology is wonderful it's got built-in scales to ensure proper calibration they've got batteries figured out that's a non-issue anymore and there's so many great built-in safety systems that are really second to none it can see where it's going that's the best way i can describe it from terrain to power lines all those things but my favorite part is the user interface you can see right here i mapped out randy's home farm and set the drone up for flight and one thing's for sure you're definitely going to see more drones spraying crops this year for this week in agribusiness i'm chad colby